Yo, 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 Lazy Eagles 215.entertainment TV. Huh. You guessed it, man. Hit that like button, man. Also, hit subscribe, share, comment, man. All that good shit. We here. We here. We ain't going to stop. Definitely about to do a quick little reaction recap, everything like that. Power Book 2, Power Book Force, Season 2, Episode 1. Quick reaction, man. Some quick thoughts. You already know about to just break it down real quick. Um, I enjoyed it. It was a 7.5 out of 10. Um, honestly, not really expecting that much out of this show at all. Just something to hold us over until Raising Cane to come out. I'm going to continue to cover it with my big brother, Detroit Kings. But, man, what I got from it was I think Diamond and Tommy need to stick together. Jannard's a fucking traitor. Jannard's a bitch-ass nigga trying to kill his brother. He's a fuck nigga, man. I'm telling you, man. I've never witnessed nobody trying to kill their own family. That shit is not cool. And I'm not going to defend Jannard. Jannard is a whole bitch out here. I think Claudia's going to end up killing Vic. I think Claudia's going to end up killing her dad. Claudia's becoming unhinged. If you guys notice, Claudia's becoming unhinged. I'm just being honest here. Tell me what you see. Claudia is not all the way there. Now, I think that it's going to be a shift in characters, meaning like Diamond might, they might have to put like a Diamond versus Jannar war type thing. Then have like a Claudia versus Tommy war. I don't think they're related to, to, to them. I don't think Tommy and Claudia is related at all, but I do think that it's going to be more characters coming and everything like that. Now, the bitch that Tommy's fucking with, the Spanish girl, I think her brother's not going to like that. And her brother's going to be very dangerous and going to be trying to come at Tommy's head. Now, that's a whole other situation. I like how they're trying to expand Chicago and bring in different characters to what we really know. It ain't trying to make it a small fucking town like the shot. They're trying to show you that it's a big, expansive world and there's different gangs and, and criminal organizations and all that, right? Man, when Claudia went in there, man, the crazy scene I saw, she went and shot that girl in the face. I was like, damn. You know what I'm saying? The girl didn't even want to be there. She said she ain't about that life, and Claudia killed her. I think Claudia is going to be a monster. Claudia is going to be a savage, guys. In my opinion, Claudia is the one to watch out for. I'm not scared of Jannard because Jannard is half retarded. Jannard don't know what to do, what to run. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, and I knew, I knew that nigga was going to turn cold. He was going to turn cold on um on CBI. I knew that was going to happen. I knew Diamond, man, listen, bro. I look back at my wife and said, you have no idea. And look what happened at the end of the fucking episode. That nigga got smoke. He got his ass shot in the face, too. All I'm saying is this, man. The Serbs, the Serbs are there. Um, they they causing havoc. They said they want the block, but that's going to be a constant war with them. It's going to be bullets flying fucking with Tommy Egan, okay? You guys know this. It's going to be bullets flying fucking with Tommy Egan. But I got a question, though, right? Um, do y'all think D-Mac going to die this season? Do y'all think D-Mac is going to end up going to New York? I mean, I think he's going to end up going to New York when Tommy get killed. I honestly, man, and my, on my channel, I like jumping to conclusions on my channel, on my shit. I like doing that. I think Tommy's going to, I think Tommy's going to go when Tommy's going to die. Obviously, I believe Tommy's going to die in this series. But I think he's going to, I think when he does, I think D-Mac is going to find himself in New York with Tariq and Braden, in my opinion. I'm just being honest here. Well, it's my opinion. Um, I think Dom is eventually, he might not, I think Dom might get his own book. I don't think he's going to die. Um, I wonder what happened to the reporter. Is he still messing with the reporter? I might have to go back and watch the episode again. I didn't watch it again, but I don't know if he's still messing with that reporter, but he got to watch her. I know she's in love with him and he's in love with her, but he has to watch that reporter, in my opinion, honestly. Um, you know, Jannar, man, like I said, bro, Jannar, you and Tommy better team up and go make some fucking money because it's going to be a long season for you, bro. You're not going to be able to win. You're not going to be able to get over on Tommy, bro, or, or, or Diamond at all. Them two together is going to be dangerous. You got the muscle in the brains. Now they're trying to make Tommy more, more intelligent and all that. Now Tommy got somebody that's plugged into the hospital. You know what I'm saying? He messing with a nurse now. So in my opinion, bro, it's going to be a pretty good season. Just something to hold us over until Raising Candy come out, in my opinion. Um, what else did I notice in here? Um, okay, Claudia is a savage. I think Vic going to end up on dope. Cocaine is something on crack, whatever, man. Vic is just so weak, man. He's so fucking weak, bro. Um, and I think, you know, I think uh what's what's the dad name, man? I think he he gonna he gonna I almost call that nigga Weston. <laughs> I think I think Claudia gonna kill Pops, the dad. He need to die anyway. The nigga with a, he need to die anyway, bro. He really do. He's a fucking prick. He the reason why the kids like that, bro. He need to die anyway. He killed that girl. He killed Vic, he killed that girl, bro. He really he's an asshole for that, man. Let your son live. You can't live through your kids. Motherfucker, that's why your ass dying slow of cancer, motherfucker. That's why right there, nigga, ain't about to croak, nigga. I hope you do, too. Fuck that nigga. Everybody saying, oh, keep him on, keep that, keep him on, keep him on, you know what I'm saying? Hell no. Fuck it. Oh, he's a good actor. I don't give a fuck, man. His character's a 
bitch ass nigga, man. He's selfish. He's toxic parents. He's toxic as fuck, bro. In my opinion, he's toxic as hell. Let me see what this nigga name is, man. Hold on. I could. I'm trying to. I'm not trying to reach real quick. Hold on. What's the nigga name? Oh yeah, Flynn. Walter Flynn. Fuck Walter Flynn. Walter Flynn. I hope they fucking kill you three times over, nigga. I hope. They, I hope the cancer kill you too. Why you dead? Fuck Walter Flynn, man. Killed that girl, innocent girl, for no reason, bro. Because you want this nigga to marry a fucking Irish woman. Nigga, it's fine. Let your son marry who you want to want to marry who you want to marry. You would have had, you would have had Vic in control mentally. If you would have accepted the way that man was living his life, your son, you would have had Vic in control mentally. Okay. And then physically, oh, love him. I'm going to represent my son. I want my son to run my organization. I want my son to make sure everything good, you know what I'm saying, before everything, you know, push come to shove. But now that you did that, Vic about to end up either on crack or he about to end up setting up you with Claudia. I think that Claudia is going to try to mastermind Vic weak ass to kill Walter Flynn, in my opinion. That's what I'm getting at. That's what I think is going to end up happening. So you know what? In my opinion, like I said, I give the episode a 7.5. I'm going to start putting out more um, more videos, you know what I'm saying, instead of doing all the live and stuff, you know what I'm saying, because my big brother Detroit said, you know, the algorithm is crazy. It's weird. So I'm just going to start po popping out more videos, you know what I'm saying, and instead of doing, like, lives every day type shit, you know what I'm saying, because, you know, we got to make sure this algorithm is fit for us. And you already know, man. I'm going to be here, man. I'm be on Detroit's channel. We're going to, like, live stream it together. Or I'm going to be on his channel, whatever, every Friday. Uh, go at 1 20 1 15 in the morning we're gonna do that we're gonna split it up you already know what it is man we're just gonna be on there talking this shit but like i said man i think tommy i think i think this this show is gonna be pretty good this year it's definitely is it has a better outlook i feel like they fixed a lot of things from last year but watch out for claudia i'm telling y'all man watch out for claudia claudia is gonna be a problem i'm telling y'all man for real watch out for claudia um, and I, I, I think Walter Flynn's days is numbered, man. Claudia is going to be a savage, bro. I'm not scared of Jannard, and I think D-Mac is heading to New York. But we out of here. Definitely hit the sub button, like, subscribe, share, comment, all that good shit. We out of here. Peace.